Leia, last time we talked, you oh, were that's st- right. last time we talked, you were still on Twitch, no? I was on Twitch and have you ever um, talked about bald. how that whole pro yeah, okay. Yeah, Dude, yeah. I don't think we talked about the band. Now I can finally say what the fuck I want to say. Yeah. I got indefinitely suspended from Twitch because my kick chat chat box was in the top right. And do they never been anyone over that shit? It's they they ban me for unmoderated um control over a chat. But like that's so stupid because that like people's Twitch chats all say a bunch of slurs all the time. We okay. Do you understand? You, Does yeah, that yeah, your chat was going crazy. My chat was going. I had the kick chat saying. overlay on my Twitch stream, mm. and they obviously were like, "Oh, he's streaming on kick," and we feel some type of way about that. And there's you know slurs being typed in the chat, and so they they obviously was like, were, they were like, "Fuck it," they were just being petty, bro. They didn't have to do that. A bunch of streamers do a bunch of crazy wild shit all the time, so yeah. they get away with it. But you're not stupid. Like you you had a plan. Like I'm probably gonna go to kick. No, I knew I was going to kick. On you guys were, I knew I was going to kick for months. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I knew it. Um, and honestly, a lot of people call me crazy. A lot of people call me crazy. But look now, now we have me, XQC. We got Drake on there. We got fucking, I got, I can't announce, I can't announce. When is this dropping? Thursday. Oh yeah. So I can't announce who the next big signing is, but we're getting everybody, bro. We're going to take Twitch over. And honestly, I want to say one thing for the cameras because people really have this shit fucked up. It's not fuck Rumble. It's fuck Twitch because Rumble and Kick really should be on the same shit. Letting people really say how, say what they want and shit like that. So. But uh, how, because I've been watching, I see all the clips too. It seems like you're super involved in the kick signings. Oh, yeah. Yeah, can, are, can you say what yeah, your bro. relationship is I got like equity. With- Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. but like how, like, are you going out and pursuing these guys and being like, Yo, of course, gotta- but I don't, I don't take cuts off my, like, for example, when we got Bruce, right? Bruce yeah. is my, Bruce is my good friend. I forgot to mention him when I was bringing up the big signings. Bruce is huge. We got, when we got Bruce, right? I told him straight up, I said, Yo, bro, I have equity in this shit. I don't, I don't care to take a percentage off you. I don't care. I don't want a percent. I got equity. I'm good. I'm very upfront with people that I have equity and I'm ownership of the company, a percentage of the company. So I don't want percentage off their specific deals. I don't yeah. care for that. I don't care to do that. What's the biggest switch up content wise from Twitch to kick? Being whatever, saying, saying and doing whatever the fuck you want and not having a consequence. So you don't worry about whatever you say. Yeah, I don't really care. There's no party that's like, fuck like. But now I'm really on some shit. Like people really get, I don't want to hurt people. But when I was going on that little run, you know, that little Twitter run of saying like, oh, there's two genders and stuff. I wasn't doing it to hurt anybody. I said that. But everyone says that. Yeah. But I said that because people were trying to cancel me on Twitter for shit. Did you actually, did you get canceled for saying that? Or Fuck no. no. There's okay. no such thing as cancel culture. Yeah. yeah. There's deplatformatization, however you say it. But like, you know, when you have, you know, people like, you know, you have good people over at Kick and like Rumble and stuff like, you know, it's, they're, they're going to take care of you.